What's up guys, IFEB Pro and Warrior McDonald here for IFEB AMA and today we are covering the topic of what to do when you're not feeling your muscles squeeze, you're not feeling your muscles contract when you're training in the gym. So, One thing I want to start with here, and it's not something I think many people would think of, and that is going to be for you guys that who are enhanced, and that is going to be low estrogen. Um, so I think this is something that occurs when people are running a cycle. Um, you know, maybe it's test, you know, master on, uh, for example, and maybe they have some AIs in the mix as well, right? Um, what can happen is because obviously if you're running test and master on, master on is going to act as a AI. And then you throw some AIs on top of that, you know, to keep things safe. Obviously, you don't want to get estrogen getting too high and getting gyno or anything like that, but you actually drive your estrogen too low. And if you do that, it's gonna seriously affect your body's ability to have a good mind-muscle connection and even get good pumps in the gym. Uh, not to say your workouts won't be effective, but when your estrogen is low, it makes it hard to really like feel the muscles, right? It, it kind of feels like things are flat. So that's definitely something I would keep an eye on. It's something I've experienced myself even more recently. I was doing a test mass primo cycle. Uh, test was at a thousand, primo was around 600, uh, mass around was around 600. Uh, I even had some AIs in there early in the cycle, uh, but noticed pretty quickly, like I was having an okay my muscle connection, but not getting the pumps I should have been getting considering the amount of food I was eating and you know the PEDs I was taking. So eventually I dropped the AIs because I thought, okay, I probably don't need these. Uh, and that didn't really change much. So I actually gave it some time and then eventually dropped my master on dosage in half, which allowed my estrogen to come back up into a normal range. And then after that point, my workouts were amazing. You know, crazy my muscle connection, crazy, crazy pumps, crazy pumps in my life, uh, which made sense to me for the amount of food I was eating and everything like that. Um, so that's definitely something to keep an eye on if you're in the gym feeling flat, not having that good mind muscle connection, not getting good pumps. Um, maybe don't just make decisions based on that in, in terms of taking out AIs and stuff like that. Cause obviously if you do that, estrogen comes up too high, you can have some bad side effects of aromatization, uh, but go get your blood work checked, check your, where your estrogen is at. And if it's low, then that's going to be the culprit, right? Uh, but say for example, you do that and your estrogen is normal. Okay. Well, I think the other thing you need to consider is But if you have your blood pressure in check, then there's nothing wrong with using. And the third reason that you might be having issues with getting a good squeeze, good muscle contraction is actually the itself. Um, so, you know, something that we've all been guilty of and we all see it in the gym all the time. So a lot of times it just means for us to drop our egos as lifters and do what we need to do, not necessarily, not necessarily do what we want to do. Um, so yeah, guys, that's my three tips to help you guys out if you're having trouble feeling the muscles contract in the gym.